If you're going to install a Tapcon concrete anchor, make sure you're using the correct size drill bit. You don't want to drill a hole that's too big so that there's not enough material for the threads and the screw to grab onto. This is the suggested 532nd bit for the smaller 316th Tapcon, which you can see is obviously too large. It's not going to leave enough material. What you could do is get a metric masonry bit. That's right, you can get a metric masonry bit, as you can see in this chart. A 532nd bit equals about a 4 millimeter metric. But if you have a 3.5 millimeter or even a 3 millimeter drill bit, you're going to drill a smaller hole, and that Tapcon anchor is going to go right into it and grab much more of the concrete material to give you more holding power. Same with the 3 sixteenths bit recommended for the quarter inch Tapcon. You could use a 4.5 millimeter bit to make a slightly smaller hole. This is especially important if your hammer drill tends to wobble around and you're and, in, and you're not holding this hammer drill completely level and perfectly straight, it's going to make a hole that's too large. So here I am installing the 3 16 This is not exactly a scientific test here, but I can see that this, this anchor is snug in that concrete. Good thing about Tapcons, you can take them out, but then I wouldn't recommend using the same hole for another bit because then the threads could be stripped. Here I am using a five millimeter bit for the quarter inch Tapcon, which ended up being a little bit too big. As you saw on that chart, five millimeters is actually slightly larger than a 3 16 bit, which is recommended here. So in that case, a 4.5 millimeter bit would have been perfect. This, this anchor went in and it held okay especially both of them would hold especially well with sheer strength but i give it a little hammer strength test hammer pull out test and they do eventually pull out the one on the right the quarter inch one which i used a slightly larger hole came out much easier the other one i practically had to put all my body weight down on this hammer but either one would be good for shear strength and of course it depends on the material if you're drilling anchoring into solid concrete would be much stronger than in this cinder block here check out millimeter metric masonry bits if you want to get a smaller than a 532nd bit which is difficult to find or actually i couldn't find anything smaller than a 532nd except for these metric bits which did the trick Thanks for watching. Hope this was a helpful tip. Please subscribe for more tips just like this.